Hi everyone, welcome to my place. If you're looking for a homemade DIY natural liquid soap or body wash, I have got the perfect recipe and it only needs four ingredients. I will never go back to using soap again because this is so economical. It's got not hardly any, well it's got no harsh chemicals in and I know what they are. I've got some water, I've got some liquid soap base that my friend Sue makes from sourcenewzealand.com. If you want any of the ingredients I'm using today just go to Sue and I've got some uh, liquid glycerol or glycerine and I've got some essential uh, oils and you can use whatever you like. I've also got one of these squeegee bottles. These are fantastic. Right, into there, the first thing we need is a cup of distilled water. And normally what I do is I just get it, when it's raining, I just get a bucket and put that outside and I just gather my own rain water because I figure it's coming through the sky and hopefully it should be clean. But you know, in saying that, we don't know what particles are floating around in the air. So that goes into there. Into there we need a quarter of a cup of liquid soap. And the great thing of the soaps that, soap bases that Sue makes is that she also puts essential oils in them. So lots of the time I don't need to put anything into them. Right, a quarter of that, a quarter of a cup of that goes into there. A teaspoon of glycerol. Glycerol's really good because it sort of like draws and holds moisture. A teaspoon of that goes into there. It's quite thick, like syrup, this stuff, and you think it's going to be sticky on your skin, but it's actually not. And then I've got about 15 drops of essential oils, and I really love sweet orange. It's beautiful. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Right. And if you are at all sensitive to any essential oils, please check. And the research that I've done just recently has told me that you really shouldn't put any essential oils oils near a baby's skin until they're at least 18 months old. But hey, look, I'm not a doctor, so I just always bought it on the cautious side. Right, that goes into there. How easy was that? Four ingredients. Put the top on. Don't forget to put on the outside what it is. And then just don't give it too big of a shake up because what will happen is the soap that's base that's in there will start to activate. But this is so lovely on your skin. And once you go to this, you'll probably, possibly not go back to commercial. So easy to make. I just absolutely love this product. Now, if you've got any recipes of things that you do, please send them to me or Gmail them to me at Asta's Place on Gmail and I will share them with the rest of the world because that's what we do here. Hope you've enjoyed that. I've enjoyed sharing and I'll see you another day. Thank you.